So we're on the Armada stand here. Um, a, a massive theme of all of the exhibitions we go to is automation, and here, uh, here it is in, uh, in display again, or on display again. Now this is an Armada press brake here. It's a six ton press brake. Got a 1.3 meter um, scope for components here. But you can see the robot here, what it's doing, it's actually changing the tools as well. Um, you can change the grippers on this to change the tools, and then you change the grippers on this to change uh, to a different part. And I think what the machine is actually doing at the moment, or what the robot's doing at the moment, is getting ready to set up for the next, the next part. But what you can see here, this is where it all starts. So here's the, the four different um, applications, should we say, that are going to be uh, are going to be formed on this press brake, and they're picked up and put into the press brake. Obviously, the tools, the correct tools, are put into the press brake for each specific part. Then the part is then bent, shaped, whatever you want to, uh, however you want to describe it. And once that process is finished, the robot will then then take the finished part off and it'll put it on the output conveyor. Now, you imagine all of the manual handling that would normally go into this uh, this process. You'd have to change the tools yourself. You'd have to set the machine. You'd then have to uh, move. Uh, the parts or the uh, the application around for the different forms and the different bends. All of that there could be there could be up to five or six or even more processes than that. Um, take the part off, put it on an output conveyor. All of that takes time and involves manual handling, and that's what's on show here. This is a total solution um, for creating those parts here on show at Black Expo from Armada.